What's going on guys, Sam if man here bringing you a video of Daisy and the update and this one's mainly about the new town. Now it hasn't quite got a name yet and it, it that's not really a problem. It's got a Russian name but obviously I'm not a Russian translator so I need someone else to uh, translate it for me and it's, it's a very good town anyway. It's quite rural, it's quite... It's not small, but it hasn't got the stuff that Cherno or Electro has. It's not huge. It's quite small. It's got a lot of little buildings, but it's got some very good buildings now. It's got stuff like, it's got quite a few piano houses, if you don't know know what piano house is the one I'm going into now. They have pianos in, but they always spawn decent stuff. They used to be better, but... They still spawn good stuff, so that's not a problem. It's got a fire station in, and it's got a supermarket, which I think is just up on the right. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. I haven't spent too much time, and it, it's quite a good war zone. Like now, people spawn up here, which is it's a bit unexpected for a new town, but it's great. Honestly, it's absolutely great. I think it's fantastic. See, this is a different piano house. I think it's got about four in. So, make what you will of that. But it's quite good for holding your ground, standing your ground. There's not much in the way of, like, people being able to spot you. You can always make an escape. And it's going to be quite a hard place to learn. And then, always a good thing, they've got a fire station. So, if you need someone who's doing overwatch, you can always get someone in the fire station. And it's just great. I... I honestly believe that this is one of the best towns already. Bearing in mind, I haven't spent too long. I've spent about an hour and a half in the town. And I actually did get ambushed, which is why I think it's so good. Now, the, any place where you have to be on your toes is great. Even now, Cherno. Cherno's not the same as it used to be in the mod. It's just literally... No one really goes down there, and I, to be honest, I run straight through it. I have never been kill, killed in Cherno on the standalone, so it's somewhere like this where you can pick a decent place to win a battle is great, and I think that's good, and there won't be as much camping. Now, this is weird. Just watch. Just watch. Try to go back down. Try to go back down dead now i understand they have a lot of glitches in daisy i went back and i actually didn't get shot i thought i got killed by a crossbow once me and purdy worked it out but no i just glitched on a ladder and i found all my stuff but my pants ruined so i died and now this part is just a little quick to show you binoculars now this will be the last episode but it's just the binoculars and i didn't want to leave these out i didn't know where to fit them in but basically they're quite decent now they are a bit harder than if i this was when i first found them and you can work them better than i did here but definitely they are quite cool like right. once i get them working you have to be standing up and to work them very well and they've got a decent level of zoom on them so you don't always now need a long range scope to actually scope out an area you can use your binoculars and you'll be happy as larry so that's me guys that's all the updates for this part and when the next updates come i'll let you know sam if man out